Hey guys, what's up? Tyler here from T Game and Tech, and today on the Dragon Rider Network, I'm bringing you guys a review of the free game in the App Store called Flow. And Flow is actually under the name Flow Free on the App Store because the actual app Flow is something different, but this one's Flow Free, and it's basically a puzzle type game. And so you have a couple options when you start it. You have free play, time trial settings, about more games. I'm just going to go over free play because it basically explains the whole game inside of it. So if we just go to free play right here, we have a regular pack and we have a jumbo pack, which is for the iPad. And so you can play this game on the iPad. It is iPad compatible, so there is an iPad version. And these levels are, um, they have a lot of grids, and it's kind of hard to do them on the phone because you have a smaller screen. We're just going to pick the regular pack and we're just going to start out with the one easy level. So the point of this game is to connect the colors to each other while also filling up the whole grid. Um, so for example, if you connected all the colors but you still had a couple of black spots empty, you wouldn't be able to pass the level. So basically to connect them, all you got to do is drag. Simple as that. And that's how you pass a level. And so you go next level. And it takes you to the next level. So if I go back. Uh, in the next section, next level up after you finish these um, these first couple here, you get to this next section that's a 6x6 six six grid. And so they're a little bit harder. You get a couple more colors sometimes, and so you just try to, you have to try to connect the colors. Now, as you can see, I blocked the red one in, so what do I have to do to get it out? Um, if you do that, it just breaks the path, so you have to try to work away another way around. Now, some of the levels... Um, can be pretty challenging, but some of them actually can be pretty easy. Um, so there's a there's a different mixture of level difficulties. Um, for example, we can go the whole way up to hard nine by nine. I haven't done this one yet, so I have no idea. But as you can see, how hard this can get up to. Um, you have all these different colors you're trying to line up with, and all the different grid patterns and paths you can take. But I mean, you can guess. And these larger ones are going to take you more time to figure out. So you do get a lot of content for it being a free game. All of these levels right here, um, you get this pack, the easy, kind of easy, medium, 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 hard, and then hard. So there are a pretty good amount of levels here to play on the iPhone. Now you can go back and you can try to play the iPad levels. Um, these are 14 by 14. These are the hardest. And you can see how many grids there are and how many different colors. This would be even hard on the iPad, but it'd be really hard on the iPod or an iPhone because you're trying to see where you're doing and the grids are so small you can't really tell what you're doing. So let's go back. You can click more levels. You go to the level store. Can't connect right now because I'm in airplane mode, but you can buy more levels as in-app purchases. So in our settings, you can just change the volume of the sound, labels, reset your progress would mean reset the game or restore your purchases if you're getting it on a different device. About, just about the game. So that has been a really quick review of the game Flow. So I like this game. I would suggest it if you like puzzle games. This really works your brain. Some of them are pretty easy, but there are a couple that are actually pretty hard. So the level of difficulty really varies. Um, sometimes you have an easier grid that's five by five, and sometimes you have a really hard grid that's five by five. It's just different and it's mixed up throughout the levels. So if you guys would be interested in this game, I'd highly suggest you download it. It's for free, so it's not going to cost you anything. And if you don't like it, you can just delete it. Like I said, it's available for the iPhone, the iPod Touch, and the iPad. And so you can head over to the App Store to pick it up right now. So I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you guys should subscribe to the Dragon Rider Network. And also feel free to check out my channel, T Game and Tech, where I review other tech and game related items and products. So once again, thank you guys for watching this video. And stay tuned for more videos on the Dragon Rider Network.